this, verse 1, that in the last days there will come times of difficulty. He goes, in the last days, which I think most of us believe we're in, the last days, he says, it's, it's going to be times of difficulty. The, the, the term there, some of your Bibles may say terrible. Like there's just going to be these terrible times in the end. See, times are changing. And if you go to other countries, you see just how bad it is for believers. And we're heading more and more that way. Man, it used to be, when I grew up here in America, it used to be that I could just go to Sunday school, right? Just go to Sunday school class, learn the Bible, you know? And then, and then I can go to youth group and have, you know, pizza nights and stuff and do good stuff with all my little Christians in my youth group. And then, you know, and then after that, I can go to a college group and, you know, go hang out with the college group. And then I can go to a singles ministry, you know, like this, not this massive, but, you know, singles ministry, you know, and, and have something like that. Then, then maybe one day, you know, be part of a, a small group Bible study whether it's singles or couples or whoever kind of raise our kids and start the process all over again and kind of keep these little safe environments going, 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 going. But I think we all know that's not the future. That it's going to get hard, really hard to take a stand on anything. And living in San Francisco, I see the future of Dallas. <laughs> Um, we're not going to become more like you. The world's going more and more the way my city is. And it's, it's a scary time. The things my kids have to put up with, no youth group's going to help them. The things my kids are going through, high school group, it's not enough. Not even close. They better deeply know this book. And the Holy Spirit better be in them.